Let's move to Colorado now, where crews are still searching for three people missing after flash floods on Tuesday. More rain expected there through the end of the week. News Nation's Vicente Arenas from our Denver station KDVR joining us with the latest. Vicente, with more rain on the way, are there more flooding concerns? Uh, huge concerns, Nicole, because anytime any amount of rain moves through the mountains, it just rolls down the mountain because of all the wildfires that we've had here. So what you see happening are these flash floods. You see these mudslides. We had another one today. Storms predicted in the mountains tonight. All this on top of the devastation that we saw just down the road here. Today we got our first look at an area that was devastated where five homes were just washed away by a flash flood. We saw a family that was able to go back in today. The woman was shaking and in tears. Her home was intact, but she knows that her neighbors lost everything they had. And we also learned today, Nicole, very sad news that the one woman who's dead and the three people who are missing are all members of the same family. And here is the one thing that really caught me by surprise is that the sheriff's officers are saying, we don't even know where to search because so much water came through here that the missing people could be anywhere. So the concern tonight continues. There are other people that are being allowed to go back into the area of devastation just a few at a time. They're allowed to go back in to see if their home is intact. And as I said earlier, that was that one woman. She was hugging someone, just crying because her home was intact, but she was so sad because her neighbors are still lost this evening up here in Larimer County. Nicole? Yeah, we hate to hear that. Hopefully they will be able to locate those three missing people. All right, yeah. Vicente, thank you.